guys, Steph here. So today I thought in light of the upcoming drama, Kill Me, Heal Me, that I would do a Korean drama preview, which is where I talk about what I have seen about this drama and why I'm looking forward to it. Today's drama preview is Kill Me, Heal Me uh, with Ji Sung and Hwang Jung Um who we actually just recently saw, and by recent, I mean 2013, saw together in the Korean drama Secret. Well, actually, I didn't quite see them together in Secret because I didn't watch Secret, but I did watch the kissing scenes, and they are back together in a drama that has an interesting, unique plot line. You have a guy who's a rich dude who had some obviously pretty traumatic experiences, and he's got some disassociative identity disorder, also known as multiple personalities, and uh, he's got seven different personalities. His seven personalities, and I will name them, are Cha Do Hyun, which is like the normal one, the one that he had before he like went through torture and like had his head dipped repeatedly in water and who knows what else under the torture of people who kidnapped him. The second personality is Shin Se Ji, Shin Se Gi. I'm not sure if I pronounce that right. Um, he is a flamboyant fashionista rocker who to me, in looking at the trailer in the very closing scene where in the where he shuts the door on Cha Do Hyun's face, uh, looks a lot like Act. Gotta admit, he's got the glittery, like, gold jacket, and he's got the guy liner, and he's got the earrings that he's rocking out, and he definitely looks like Gak, and that makes me excited. Gotta admit, I'm a big Gak fan, even though that's Japan. Other personalities include Mr. X, who wears a kitty mask, like the, the kitty face mask and uh, likes wine. He's like swirling wine for like wine tasting. And uh, Nana, who's a cute little girl who wears bows in her hair and has a candy lollipop and uh, plays with teddy bears. And then he's got Yosub, uh, who's playing with a noose. I'm hoping that he's not like the one who is suicidal and wants to kill himself. Uh, and then you have Yona, who I'm guessing is a teenage girl because she's laying on a bed and she's putting lipstick on, though she's wearing a sweatshirt. So, you know, like that's pretty teenish, I gotta admit. Um, and then you have the last one that is in the trailer is Pariba. Yeah, Pariba, who likes who must like fishing because he's got a fishing pole and I'm guessing he likes the tropics. He wants to go fishing in the tropics because he's wearing like a Hawaiian print, extremely loud and flamboyant shirt. So he's got some issues that he needs to work out and um, it's being worked out with the help of Hwang Jung Um who's wearing the epic Korean drama coat that almost every Korean drama lady wears. It's like a big gray like down coat with a hood with fur on the edge and that's about all that we've seen of her so far in the trailer she looks very dramatic and she's usually kind of teary-eyed and she's his doctor private secret doctor because he can't let his diagnosis out i'm actually kind of psyched to see this drama i think it's actually going to be kind of interesting definitely want to check out the flamboyant fashion eco fashionista rocker personality and I'm also intrigued to see how they're going to actually tackle this subject because I know people who've gone some gone through some really traumatic events and I actually knew somebody who did have disassociative identity disorder and I've done extensive research on the topic because of it. So I really am intrigued to see how this is going to be represented in a Korean drama. And so I'm gonna check it out, and I hope you guys do too. Uh, what are your thoughts on Kill Me, Heal Me? Have you seen it already? Because by the time this comes out, it's probably gonna be closer to the time that the drama actually comes out. Maybe you'll see it before you watch this video. If so, what do you think? Let me know down in the comment section. Am I totally off base? Do you, do you think that this drama is going to be terrible? What are your thoughts on this drama? Let me know in the comments. Also, be sure to press the thumbs up, like a button, just, you know, give it a click, and subscribe, you guys. That's it. Happy drama watching. Bye. I'm 
really, really digging the kisses from this drama and it's just bringing tears to my eyes. I'm so proud of you, Pak Shanae. Thank you. Ejunksa. Just thank you. <laughs>